Hello. Ooh, I'm a mess of unscratchable edge. Oh, shake a leg. Oh, if there, was a, if there was a wall I could get up against, if there was a, a rough place I could rub up against, I'd have a really good edge. Oh, I'm all itch. Can, can you scratch my edge? Go on, just give me, give me, come on, come on. Just, oh, yeah, that's great. Oh, lovely, yeah, Let go. On. Nice job. Go on. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Who are you? I'm a goat. I'm a man. I'm the brother of Pan. Oh, I'm a, no! I'm the brother. Oh, I'm you! I'm you! I'm a goat. I'm a man. meant her no harm. But as she ran through the forest, a snake bit her heel. Satyrs understand only pleasure. In the face of pain, they are like children alone in the dark. I'm a goat. I'm a man. It wasn't me. Just a snake. Just a snake. Eurydice. Speak to me. Eurydice. Don't leave me! But her eyes just stared past him and her mouth gaped as wide as a grave. <gasps> He took his wife in his arms and carried her out of the forest to where his people were still dancing. And his words chilled their hearts. Eurydice is dead. Oh. We will give her body to the woods laid out for harvest fires. And when we have done with our lament, I will break my lyre. For since she is dead, there will be no more music. Bring her back! Don't let her die. Help me. Please help me. You, you can do it. Your music can do anything, can't it? Make it bring her back. Use this to bring her back. Please, please, you must. You must help me. Zeus and the immortal, hear me! I, who have calmed the seas and made rocks move with my music, I will charm death himself. I will go down to Hades and bring her back. Do you hear me? I will bring her back from the arms of death himself! And so armed only with his music, Orpheus went down into the underworld, a land from which no one has ever returned. There is almost no sound in Hades. They have a dog there, don't they? They have a three-headed dog, Cerberus, if you must know. But this isn't a story about dogs. This is the story of Orpheus, who went down into Hades itself to bring back his loved one. He picked his way down towards the river Styx, the river you must cross to reach the underworld. And there below, he saw his wife walking towards Charon, the ferryman of Hades. One oboe. Eurydice, don't drink! This is the water of Lethe. The water that makes you forget. Everyone must drink it. It's sweet. Eurydice! Can't you feel all those painful things going? Going. Eurydice didn't turn as the boat drifted off through the mists. Orpheus could only wait for the ferry to return, knowing there was no other way across. One oboe. The crossing is one oboe. No oboe, no crossing. Charon, Charon. The boat, it moved. I know. The souls of the dead have no weight. Your hands, they're warm. I'm alive. Yes. Your lips, your skin. Charon. Charon. I haven't heard music. Oh, I don't know. So long. Doesn't it soothe you, eh, sir? Huh? Reaching the far side of the river. Orpheus stumbled on through the cold marshes, with Eurydice gliding ahead of him, always Eurydice. just out of reach. He called to her, but as he did so, the mists rolled back before his eyes. And 
there in front of him was Hades, the king of the underworld, with Persephone, his queen, by his side. Who comes uninvited to my kingdom? I am Orpheus, king of Thrace, son of Calypso. And what does King Orpheus seek from Hades? The soul now before you in judgment. Eurydice, my wife. No soul returns from my kingdom. Love is stronger than death. <laughs> Nothing is stronger than death, little musician. Fear me. I am the bold audience at the theater. A knock at the door when you least expect it. I am the one whose name must not be spoken for fear I hear it and sit next to you. I am the pain in your arm at four in the morning, the headache that will not shift. The sour taste in your mouth of everything you ever did. I am waiting, little musician, and one day I shall come for you also. Then you will see your wife once more. But Orpheus would not give up Eurydice. He played again, this time to the queen. He will not listen. Or if he pretends to listen, he is lying. Oh, death cheats too.